pay if you count to 10 for me. Are you serious? Yeah, just count to 10. This is a mic what? test. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, great. Now, if you would just look at Jason and say mm -hmm. your name. Jan Mathis. And how do you spell Mathis? M-A-T-H-I-S. Okay, and uh, uh, first, what brought you to Guardian MD? And when you answer your questions, you if, you can, answer. if you can answer in the form of the question, meaning, well, what brought me to Guardian MD is this. It kind of makes it easier for me to edit rather than you okay. just start off. Okay. Uh, what brought me to Guardian MD um, is the fact that um, it became apparent I would no longer be able to see uh, my physician, Dr. Page, um, and he offered an additional time with him, and um, he became more accessible through this uh, program. And so I decided to uh, learn more about it and decided to try it. Uh, what are your thoughts so far? What's your experience been so far with Guardian MD? Well, I've had a very good experience. Um, I've been able to email him back and forth about very minor problems or concerns that I had, and I was able to get a, a, almost an immediate answer or within 24 hours um, an answer to my questions. Um, then last Saturday I woke up and was quite ill and quite frightened uh, by my illness. and. I wanted to see how Guardian would work, so I asked my husband to call the number because this is, was on a Saturday morning, which most times doctors are not that available. And so he called Dr. Page's cell phone. He was able to describe what was happening to me, and within the hour, Dr. Page returned our call. And he was able to uh, uh, explain to me what was happening, that it was benign, and shortly thereafter, he sent me uh, two email messages with one being an exercise program uh, that for uh, my uh, extreme dizziness, and the other was online material that I could read. And I experienced almost immediate results um, and was much better. And it was wonderful to be able to do that rather than have to drag my very nauseated body to the emergency room, and that's where we were headed. It was a frightening experience. This worked out very well for me. Oh, that's great. I mean, uh, if you were to, if a friend of yours were to ask you what what to to recommend Guardian MD, would you what would you tell them? Well, I have recommended it to uh, more than one person. Uh, who has explained to me difficulty they have had uh, getting in touch with their own physician and have explained to them the benefits that I've had just simply being able to email with a short question and I get a, an appropriate answer back. Uh, I'm also assured that if it were more serious than that, Dr. Page would tell me to come to his office. Uh, so, yes, I've recommended it to several people. Uh, is there anything else you'd want to say in closing to, that uh, about uh, Guardian MD? Oh, goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Thus far, I'm very pleased with it. I feel like um, I have, um, have greatly benefited from it. Um, Jason, can you think of anything else that comes off hand? Um, I was trying to get focused on the ease of communication. I mean, I think you touched on that some of it, you know, is um, what, uh, what a person can expect mm -hmm. in terms of uh, you know, that. So I was grateful. Yeah, what was, let me ask this. And you was What's thinking, difficult is you're asking the questions and I'm looking is. at Jason I know it is. and it's confusing it'll to my be, brain. It'll be a lot easier for you guys. <laughs> well, you go ahead and ask the questions that you, I've asked a couple. And well, that's asked, a, I'm trying to figure out how to phrase it. That's where I yeah, go ahead. guess it. Um, if you were to explain the process to mm -hmm. uh, to someone that's not a guardian member, um, 
how would you explain the benefit or the, the ease of utilizing the system? I'll explain to the users. Mm -hmm. Right. The, the benefit of the guardian system is ease of access to your physician, um, that you can access him by way of email or cell phone um, after hours. Um, you get a prompt service on appointments in the office if you need to go. Um, if you were to, um, how was your, how was your last, uh, like the last time you were sick, how were you, uh, were you describe how, how your guardian system worked and just look at Jason and Mary. Okay. Well, then I can relate. And you just say the last time I was sick which was, was last Saturday. Saturday. Yeah, okay. just kind of go through that. Okay. Uh, last Saturday when I woke up with an extreme vertigo. Uh, to the point of almost blacking out. I was very frightened and my husband became very frightened because I'm normally a very healthy woman. Um, I thought stroke, uh, but I had enough presence of mind uh, to tell my husband where to get the flow sheet that Jason sent from Guardian. And we uh, took that sheet, he called Dr. Uh, Dr. Page's cell phone and Dr. Page returned our call within the hour. Um, I was able to speak with him and tell him what was happening. And he was able to reassure me that he had been practicing for 30 years. He'd had several phone calls like that during that 30 year period, that it was a benign uh, condition and he would send me information about it. That's good, that's good. Um... What's the, what's your favorite thing about being a Guardian member? My favorite thing about being a garden, Guardian member Let's is... start again. All right. Hmm? Just start again. Okay. My favorite thing about being a Guardian member is being able to email my physician and to get an answer um, in a, an appropriate amount of time. And, and if you would expand upon that saying, and that way my, my problems are, my questions are answered and I have the peace of mind of knowing that my doctor is right within. Are you a guardian patient? <laughs> 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 on the other side, I'll, you, know, we'll right. hear that you know what I'm saying. We just kind of—I tell stories on TV, and that's kind of the way. Right. Wanna, okay. And, and I know that's what you meant, uh -huh. but just kind of—that's what. If you could kind of do that. Uh, I think the other thing is too is to maybe maybe comment on a previous prior to Guardian. You know, the, the process would have okay. been going through a awesome a, a yeah. front office desk. Or whatever. Right. And can I mention that you know I've even uh, I've had. Well, I really have never gone to a doctor very much, to tell you the truth. Uh, but I did uh, try to get one doctor, and he, he wouldn't even see a Medicare patient, even one with supplemental insurance. Uh, I, I would definitely oh, yeah. Great. Get those done. Okay. Okay, and uh, if you kind of explain to, uh, okay. to us the... All right, okay, okay. Um, I'm a very healthy person. I take good care of myself. I have good genes. Uh, but I did become, um, have some uh, disturbing symptoms uh, about three years Let's ago. Start over. Okay. You just look at Jason. Okay. okay. I think I needed a glass of wine. One more. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even drink wine. No, no. I was going to say, I don't know. Lately, you're talking enough. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Where was I going with this? Um, oh. Um, I've been a very healthy person uh, all my adult life uh, until if about three years ago and I began to have a shortness of breath that disturbed me and I uh, tried to get uh, in touch with a physician, a good physician, that I could see for a physical because I really hadn't had one in years. 
my doctor, uh, my daughter recommended uh, several doctors that she knew. Uh, I called one and they would not even see me because I'm a Medicare patient even though I had supplemental insurance. Um, I called Dr. Page's office. Um, they were very happy to see me and uh, I felt like I got wonderful care with Dr. Page. But I realized that the medical field and the medical climate is rapidly changing. And although uh, initially I wasn't very excited about paying a fee to see a physician every month, I've more than benefited from it and more than got, gotten my uh, monetary uh, expenses back with the care that, that the guardian physician, Dr. Page, has given me. And if you could say, I would recommend guardian concierge to anybody that's on Medicare. Okay. You know, mm -hmm. and you can just look at Jason and say that. All right. And that's, it, 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 you feel comfortable saying that? Yeah, I, I really would, or I wouldn't say yeah, it. I would think so. Um, I would recommend uh, the concierge care that Guardian provides, particularly for Medicare patients. That's great. Yeah, that's great. Okay, great. You want to go grab sit on grab one? Yeah, I think so. I'm sure I didn't look at all nervous. No, you look wait a second. Do you want some? My name's Roxana Largen, and I recently joined the Guardian program uh, with Dr. Page, mainly so I could have better appointments with him, kind of form a longer partnership with them for health care. Uh, how has, um, how has your, tell me about your experience with Guardian. So far with Guardian, I've noticed that my appointments are much easier to book, so I don't have to, to wait weeks or months to get an appointment. Uh, when you show up, you get right in, there's no problem. Uh, as you come in the office and get signed in, you just wait a couple minutes and you're back to see Dr. Page. Um, and then I've noticed that my appointment times with Dr. Page, instead of being 10 or 15 minutes, maybe we can spend 45 minutes going over test results. Um, what has your experience been uh, using the, the email and phone system? I haven't had to call him yet, but I've been very pleased to know that when I was traveling out of the country or even on a vacation that, you know, Dr. Page said, call me if anything happens, if you have a question, just the comfort to know that he's available. And then I have been able to contact him with email and I've been amazed at the quickness of his responses. So it's very, very handy to be able to contact him that way. Do you feel like uh, this is improving your health care? I mean, uh, your health by being knowledgeable in, 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 and being more in control? I think it does help improve my health because we're working not only to resolve the health issues that you have right now that you see in your test, but we're working together to work on a prevention program for the future. Yeah, I was going to uh, let me try to work, try to work this one. Uh -huh. Do you feel anything with, uh, can, you, can you explain uh, what may have been lacking in your previous experience versus, versus what's, uh, what you're now able to, to, to do in, in your concierge? I think prior to Guardian, it was the frustration of, of calling and needing an appointment. You say you're sick and you want to get in this week. And you call and they say, well, we don't have an availability for three weeks out. Well, by then I might feel better and I may not even need the appointment. Uh, so at the Guardian program, I've seen a big change in that, that you can get right in when you need to. A friend of yours, basically, would you recommend this program to other people? I definitely would recommend the Guardian program to other people just for the peace of mind of knowing that you have a, a partnership and better contact with your doctor. Um, and knowing I've recommended it to some of my family and knowing that they have better health care and, and more comfort in knowing their doctor and knowing that their doctor really knows them. Yeah, that she was, and you, you described the earlier just the, the peace of mind. Mm -hmm. So I was kind of trying to draw that out too. Sorry. Yeah, kind of, kind of explain, kind of 
how do you feel the, the peace of mind that you get out of Guardian? Okay, uh, the peace of mind I get from Guardian is knowing that my doctor is just an email or a phone call away knowing that if I call him or I contact him, he's not going to say, who is this person? He's going to know who he's talking to and what we're talking about. Um, the peace of mind, the knowing, too, that I can access my medical records online if I need to. Um, so if you're out of town and, and you can't remember exactly what medications you take or exactly what the dosages are because you don't have your bottles with you at the time, to know that you can pull that up on the computer and, and see everything that's there. It's just the comfort of the whole package. So if you think if somebody really wants to take charge of their own health, that Guardian is a good way to do it? I think it is. I think if you do want to take charge of your health, Guardian is a good way to do it because you know that you do have that extra time with your doctor and you're not just going to see him for five minutes and have him turn around and walk out the door. Do you plan to take advantage of the, uh, the prevention and nutrition wellness pack prevent it, or that's involved with the program um, as it becomes available? Yes, I do plan to take a... a take advantage of some of those nutrition and prevention plans that are coming along with Guardian, mainly to, to try to set a better stage for the future for my own personal health. Anything else you can think of? I'm trying to go through what you kind of got with Kurt was trying to get. Yeah. Yeah. You were trying to describe um, someone that didn't know any, anything about the Guardian program. What would you? What would, what would be the one? What would be the biggest thing you want to to give them to understand? Uh, I think the the biggest benefit I'm seeing of Guardian right now is, is my most recent appointment with Dr. Page was going through my test results, and we actually took time to break down everything that we were seeing. He made sure that I understood exactly what the test results meant, what we were going to do about it now, and what we were going to try to prevent for the future. So I think it really, it's helped me to, to spend that extra time to really understand what's going on with my own health. Do you feel he was unable to do that prior to Guardian? I think he always spent, Dr. Page prior to Guardian always spent more time with you than the average doctor but still maybe it was only 15 or 20 minutes. And now instead of waiting in the waiting room, the extra time you may actually spend a full 45 minutes talking to him personally instead of waiting a half an hour and only talking to him 20 minutes. 